Friends, buddies, pals, how you doing? Welcome back to another video. So this week is gonna be a bit of a mixed mash of fishing trips because uh, of one thing and another. So my buddy JP came over, it was real good to see him. If you watch these videos, you'll have seen me fish with him several times now. I'll link one of those up here and you can go check it out. And we went out, had a couple of days together. Unfortunately, I had a massive SD card error and it all glitched out and just deleted pretty much all of the footage of one day more or less anyway and then on the other day we actually had pretty tough fishing so what i'm going to do on that one there i'm going to show you what i managed to salvage and just give you a highlight of two days with jp just start on that line there and then just fish that fish yes <laughs> Come on, buddy. Come this way. Just a baby. All right, I'm going to nip through the bottom here and then we're going to get out of here because there's people turning up all around us. First left. Uh oh. Uh oh. He really wants to go over there. And I don't want it to go over there. That's what we came for. Sweet. Yes, freshy, freshy McFreshters. Gone. Yes. Ooh, 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 ooh. ooh. <laughs> nearly added it up in that tree. Oh! Yeah, right. Let's have a go. Just get a bit swift here. Yep. Or her. Oh! All right. <clears throat> to work for that, didn't we? Oh, come on! Yep. Oh, no! It's a Schneider nine day. Yep. Okay, this time, this time, this time. Okay. Oh, come on! <laughs> This is getting goddamn ridiculous! What happened? You lost your hand. Oh my God. <laughs> literally like seven fish in a row when we get to this piece of water i'm like jp no you go man there'll be fish here for sure just thinking i'll pick up a an average rainbow change the rig over first drift and he gets that huge brown somewhere between six and seven pound and just beautiful condition that was unreal in the uk we'd call you a jammy bastard jammy bastard <laughs> Yo! Ah, no, 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 no. The Schneider line is broken. She's <laughs> broken. <laughs> <laughs> Right, 
broke the Schneider line. We are back. The mojo is here. I can still catch a fish. I can hook it. I can put it in the net. It's brilliant. A cool, funky jawed rainbow, and I'll take one of those any day. Should be a fish there. Yep. Yeah. Oh, ho, ho, ho. JP with the ice cream scoop. <laughs> All right, that was good. I worked out really well, just kind of dragged him downstream. He was having a bit of a thrash around and then JP managed to get himself into position and uh, ice cream scoop him up in quite spectacular fashion. I don't know if it came out on here or not, but uh, it was quite funny to watch. Yeah. Made me laugh. Yeah, I like it. So yeah, that was super cool to see the bro. I'm gonna uh, catch up with him again before the end of winter for sure. Winter fishing is really, really different. It's like in a stark contrast to summer fishing where you can more easily find and expect to find water Hello. To yourself. There's a lot of people around and, a, and only a select amount of water that they can fish. So that means lots of people in the same place. So there's a few basic river etiquette guidelines that most people tend to go by. It's very simple and it's very quick. If you get to a piece of water and there's somebody fishing it, they have priority on that piece of water. I'd say just go and fish somewhere else. Leave them to it, go find a piece of water with no one in it and then go and fish there. A definite no-no. You don't just jump in ahead of them and start fishing. Never do that. That is a total dick move. If you really, really want to fish that piece of water, go have a chat with the guy that's fishing there. Go and say, hey, ask them what they're up to, which way they're fishing, are they nymphing up, are they swinging down? And then do they mind if you jump in and fish around them and go from there? I'm pretty sure in like 100% of cases, just going and having a chat with somebody means everyone ends up happy. A surefire way to upset someone is just to kind of come in, stand next to them and start fishing. It's just not the way to go. Just something, if you don't know it, now you do. And if you do know it and you don't do it, shame on you. I had an attempt the other day to try and get away from the crowds and go somewhere which is still open but more backcountry. Didn't work out so well. Yeah, what you're saying is correct, but also the universe is infinite. Keep driving, keep on driving. We'll try the Tongarero. All right, let's go have a look. Should be fish over there, right there. Trouble is, you end up here, which is not ideal. What am I supposed to do here? Other than uh, the old Low rod technique and hope for the best, and it's off. Got him. Just a baby fish, but satisfying because he didn't want to eat that. It's a cool little fish, though. Cool little fish. See you, buddy. He eventually ate the old pole position. Yep. <clears throat> First trip. <laughs> There's the eggs. Oh, God.
Ooh. Wow, that was like a streamer hit. I actually felt that because I was looking the other way. Dude, come on. Oh, wow. All right, all right, all right. Cool little fish. It was a bit of a bust that day, hard work, but I uh, managed to get a couple of fish, and at least I didn't get stuck. So what I have started doing, I have actually started putting a few things in place for South Island Diaries 6, which I'm pretty excited about already. I'm gonna get some brown trout. Right, I'm gonna leave it here. I'm gonna go home, I'm gonna edit. I'm gonna try and get out again before next week and make a video for you guys. I've got a ton of guiding coming up, so time's gonna be a bit tight, but I will do my best. Looks like we've got some weather coming in. Kinda like the calm before the storm supposed to be a lot of rain coming so that'll be good for the fishing no doubt great to see you guys thanks for dropping in leave me a comment in the comment section below give me a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed do me a favor hit the button join the team costs you nothing helps me out a heap have yourselves a great week everybody i will see you on the next one peace